unfortunate, but that's okay. You pick up, you dust off, and you get back into an offense nice and look. Out the back again, yes. Clinch Hoycard finds Forster underneath the bucket. Reset the Senators here. Makes them more aware of it too. Oh, out the back again, there we go. Again, it was almost a case of deja vu all over again. Nicole Jaw, D Saint Shaw, championship captain from last year. Forster tries to get past Rice and collects the body, collects the basket. Chloe Forster puts on the hard hat, does this tough stuff. Takes another board as well. Again, just that intensity there to win the ball, the ferociousness. Burton with the spin cycle. There you go. So it doesn't matter what you do. you just got to quell the influence in the right way. Well, paints a bleak picture for opponents there as Forster is painting a beautiful picture so far. Another basket there for the Lynx star. Just under five minutes to go in this second quarter. It's a two-point ball game. And there's a shot from long range. Mackenzie clinch card. You just can't give her that much space on that angle from beyond the three-point line. Murphy, the hot hand. Down the baseline goes Forster. Loses the handle. In trouble now. Throws it up. What trouble? No trouble at all. Clinch card. Verdon's left alone out there and really in a not-so-dangerous position. That's a dangerous position. She makes it count. And Defence laps there. Season high of 48 points during the season two, so she could go for 50 tonight. Oh, the strong. Strong from Forster, even stronger underneath the basket. We've seen the story of the Norwood Knight there in those two plays, the second chance point for the Senators and the, the shot that they would normally make, and there's a shot that Chloe Forster would normally make. She cannot be faulted for what she's done tonight she's for gonna, her side. She's going to have to get 60, and she's going to have to, she's got, what, 15 points to get in a minute and a half, to, and that's not going to help. Bowie Forster just 